So we have arrived at the basically infamous Venice. And as you can see, sorry, we'll encounter weirdos. Well, nothing wrong with weirdos. It's, the, it's actually, it's more or less. Eclectic I, people. Oh, I people feel like I'm a weirdo and eclectic, but it's just, it's Wall Street that you need to worry about. Them the people, not not weirdos. We're normal people considered to considered to uh, Wall Street, but shameless plug how he feels about Wall Street. All right, so let's so see what fun we can get into. So there's a couple of things that I should uh, forewarn you about on Venice Beach. What One, you can look forward to when you come here. Yeah, like I don't know if you guys can see over my shoulder, but like when people have CDs and they. Um, they they come up to you like listen to my music listen to my music don't and the reason is because by the time you listen then they'll be asking you for five dollars five dollars ten dollars fifteen dollars like bruh i didn't come to venice beach to listen to nobody's music i just came to enjoy myself so that's one that's one another thing that happens typically is that people um that have um what was it Oh, I call them aliens, but they're like the green people because they wear all these green outfits and they're like cannabis dealers. That's another set of people that come up to you trying to, you know, get money or uh, basically get you to... And sweetheart, what is cannabis? Tell the people, <laughs> what does cannabis mean? So, marijuana, basically. Weed dealers. Shout out to Colorado. Yeah, basically. So, <laughs> those are the people that exist on this beach and you've been warned, so... So, when you see them... Yeah. And then parking. Parking is atrocious. So those are the three things that I would say be cautious of when you come to Venice. True, but other true. than that, as you can see, oh, and then that group, big group over there, if you can see, that's like, you know, the crowds, they take forever just to do one They're act. They're trying to collect money, okay? They collect money, collect money, collect money. It's like, so by the time you see anything, you're like, you've waited 15 to 20 minutes and it's like, it's not even worth it anymore. Although there, it's pretty entertaining to see them, you know, do acrobatic flips and stuff like that, but. I ain't got no time for it. We're gonna give you a glimpse. Tell him not to be a Scrooge. No, I give you no glimpse. It is for you guys to experience this, right? Oh, Don't man. worry, y'all. We gonna, you gonna see it. No. Watch, ah. you gonna see it. Yes, thank you, black people. Obama changed things, right. okay. Thank you, OBZ. Obama, what happened? 20 dollars who? Arizona? Give it for Arizona, round of like I told you, nothing ever happens. They're still going. It's always like this every time. Like they've been waiting they, before we even got here. They have been, they have been going right. See? No, I ain't worried about these dudes. Show them the hustle is real. The hustle is annoying. attention to see this is what this is this is typical her this is this is what typically happens now we supposed to be in this this thing together and she all the way over there you know what she be doing shopping she be looking for other stuff and leaving me that's why observant so when your wife tells you that she's observant that means she's shopping that's observant Thank you see all that you can't see you won't see <laughs> oh she just went down that was like Frasier all these people are essentially here for skateboarders and if you can see I'll try to give you a view of it For all the fellas that don't have wives, there's a lot of that <laughs> on the beach. Nice save, babe, nice save. <laughs> you looking, I'm looking. Happy wife, happy life. But, so, 
Um, you have to look over my shoulder, but as we walk, you'll see the cannabis dealers. So, over to the, what side? My right side, with my right shoulder. I'm sure they can see that. Yeah. There you go. So, like I said, you have been warned. Make sure we get glasses off. Yes, sunglasses. But after we eat, yeah, all sense of all food, all food, all time. Yeah. You can't like, think straight when you're hungry. My whole thing was to come here and shoot good world, footage. Your whole her world thing was to come here and eat. eat. We know y'all can't. You can't think straight now on an empty stomach. Okay? How can we make any sound decisions on an empty stomach? <laughs> Oh man. <laughs> Plenty of places to go shopping in Venice. Uh, for t shirts to license plates to shot glasses to postcards. Um, and then you have like various artists like that sell different paintings or different sculptures. Um, pretty talented people. Oh, she has a snake on her. Um, yeah, so very interesting. So if you guys can see that. Yeah. Oh yeah. So also when you come to Venice, there's a place called the uh, Freak Show. So as you can see, this place. All right, everybody, here's the turtles with two heads. You can so, see them for free. They're right here alive. Turtles. Uh, this place is free. pretty cool yeah, to the see. They have like, yeah, the um, that's where I was saying like the weirdos, which is not bad. I mean, it's, just, it's actually pretty cool. But if you come to Venice, this is probably one of the places that you would want to come. It's like $10 or something like that. And yeah, so it's perfect. Was ducking out of my shot. Yeah. It's, all <laughs> it's all good. I need a skateboard. You want a skateboard? Yeah. You know, the only place that I wouldn't get a tattoo is here. Is Venice. <laughs> I mean, like, of all places to get one, it. yeah, just. Uh, I wouldn't even recommend it. Not, <laughs> yeah, as as just something, something I just wouldn't do the, it here. So that non-sanitation. Yeah, it just sanitary. seems very awkward. Not so sanitary. So, that guy was taking a picture of me. You think I'm famous? It's so weird. He literally, like, sat there and took a shot of me, like, you know, I, I was about Do you remember this uh, place right here? You had uh, ice cream or something here. Yeah. At one of these. I think it was the one further down, but. I remember it. So, again, like we said, there's plenty of places to eat in Venice. Um, Chantel's eating here at this pizza, Ray pizza place. All right, Matt. So, I'm getting hot. We need All to right. go find some Let's indoors. Let's go find some food. Stay tuned. Chantel is shopping for sunglasses right now. Hopefully you guys can see her. And um, yeah, so after she does that, then we'll head over to the beach. You know, we've been over here this whole time and they still haven't even done a performance there. That's what there. you always tell me. But it's gonna be 20 minutes later, so, right? So I'm gonna get these. You're good? Oh, oh wait. This is it? How are you? Thank you. All right, so now we've got some fresh shades, and I think it's time to. I wanted to show them like all the basketball stuff, like people be hooping oh, down yeah, here. Yeah, and muscle then, man. That's what I said. Yeah, those two things. So, okay. we'll show you that. And then we're gonna get closer to the water. Uh, they're running a game over here, if you can see. So. They're running a game of basketball, and yeah, why are you behind the camera? Always behind the camera. Anyway, there you have it, folks. Venice basketball, uh, Muscle Beach. So we gotta go over that way.
Just in case you guys were wondering, he missed that shot. Just in case you were thinking that he was coming down here, about to pull a Kobe, he missed. So, yeah, yeah. Oh, there goes a sign. Um, I want to show him that big red sign up there. Muscle Beach. So, cool. Over on this side, you have the, I don't know what you want to call this, adult jungle gym, essentially. <laughs> <laughs> so, you got people who just find a different way. I guess that's like CrossFit. Sorry about the gum chewing, I apologize. All right, I think I'm gonna put on my sandals though. Well. All right. So, Me too. we're gonna have to cut here briefly, folks. So that we can get get you closer to that view. Are concluding I know it looks really nice out here it is but it's, it's cold as well <laughs> therefore uh... <laughs> so we're out hopefully you enjoyed log number four cranking them out so I have to explain to you why we call it Accarelli Adventures one day You know, we've been over here this whole time and they still haven't even done a performance there. That's what there. you always tell me. <laughs>